Hi, I'm Keiko at kjmholistichealth.com. Today, I really wanted to talk about chickens and their natural cycle and just food for thought, to be honest. Um, so I've been raising chickens and alpacas for, oh, now about 14 plus years. And there's a lot that I've learned by just observing and watching. And one of the things that um, we noticed early on was that um, the chickens lay during certain times of the year and then don't lay as much other times. So they technically, I think, need like 14 or 15 hours of sunlight or light to lay. And they lay like, as if I recall correctly, about every 26 hours. So generally from like spring to maybe like September, October, they lay really well. And we free range our um, chickens. And so we don't put any artificial light or anything. So they kind of just go with whatever's available. And so just on that simple note, um, should we be eating eggs in the winter? If they don't naturally produce as many, or they're just, their body's not even designed to lay <laughs> because there's usually not enough light. And also, depending on where you live, you're gonna have different number of hours of light during different seasons. So, oh, and, and another interesting thing. So, grocery store eggs are washed. And so, they, and they're usually a little older, but when you get fresh eggs, what happens is when they lay, they put a thing called a bloom on the outside. So you don't really see it or know it, but it protects from bacteria and other things. So when we pick it up from our farm, the nest somewhere, <laughs> we have to hunt for those most of the time because they're free range. Um, they have a protective um, coating. So they can last a few weeks um, on the countertop, and if you refrigerate it, they can last about, uh, I think about three months in the fridge. So um, a lot of times the grocery store eggs are washed. <laughs> Hi. Um, part of the reason is because when you keep them either in confined areas or you get a lot of chickens, the nest gets really dirty. And so there's poop. <laughs> Sorry, that grossed you out. There's poop on the eggs. Okay, a free range chickens, Sorry, I've got all sorts of animals behind me. Free range chickens will find a clean place to um, lay and that's why we kind of have to hunt for our eggs <laughs> a lot of the time. So it doesn't get dirty. Like if, okay, so if it rains and they're trekking in mud and they, you know, lay and there's some mud on their feet, okay, there's some mud that gets on the eggs. But it's really, really rare to have poop in their um, nest or on their eggs if you give them enough space. So you don't have to wash it. it. It's very clean actually. And then we can just leave it as is. And if you wanted to wash it right before you eat it, you can do that. Okay, so there's a lot of natural mechanisms to keep eggs to last longer. Um, chicks take 19 to 21 days to hatch. They can go without food usually or water for about like 24 to maybe 24 hours to, they say up to three days. I mean, you know, <laughs> we don't usually test those boundaries, but um, because of the way that, you know, eggs can hatch and there can be slight um, variation within like a two, three day range. So once a hen sets, it takes like 19 to 21 days before a fertile egg will hatch. Oh, and by the way, uh, they don't have to be fertilized to lay eggs. Chickens will just, hens, I'm sorry, chick, okay, so hens are the girls and roosters are the male. So hens will lay regardless of whether you have roosters or not. We do have roosters, so they're generally fertile. Um, and the fertile, and so, you know, since we're free ranging, they'll just sort of lay, really Tiffany? Um, <laughs> they will lay. Um, and here's, here's what I'm talking about with the clean cleanliness. These hens that set, their, set on their eggs for 19 to 21 days to hatch their chicks will be able to hold their poop for, uh, I wanna say like probably like 10 hours because they will not mess their nest because it's not good for the chicks when they hatch. <laughs> so they will hold it in and then, you know, when they get a short break, they usually get off their nest a couple times during the day to um, feed. And you will see like this massive chicken poop um, because they're holding it all in. So there is really no reason for eggs to be super dirty and need to be washed 
but depending on how they are cared for, um, you know, it's just kind of how things are, <laughs> but just something to know. Okay, so let's see. Anything else I wanted to mention? Oh, okay, so another thing. With the feed, um, so when we free range them, we do provide some layer feed um, and we do like to give them, throw some scratch or Milo out for them. Um, but they will go and get bugs and they'll eat grass and um, they will pretty much eat anything that they can catch and chase. <laughs> Sometimes it's super gross. Like I'm seeing them with little baby snakes and they're really, you know, proud. <laughs> Um, and I'm just like, ah, <laughs> yuck. You know, a couple of days I'm like, I don't, I don't think I want to eat eggs. <laughs> but, um, you know, we see them, you know, carry around dead mice. And yeah, chickens are interesting. They, 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 they will eat anything. Um, so when they're free ranging, their yolks are like just orange. They're really kind of like, um, Oh, I don't know. When you crack it, it's, it doesn't have this, bleh, you know, like it, it kind of has this perkiness. That's the word, perkiness. And it looks delicious and exciting. And, you know, it's just like, ooh, I love how it looks. Okay, so we just kind of give them whatever. Plus, they free range, get the sunshine, which is amazing. And the eggs look amazing. Okay, but if you keep them confined, they don't usually get all those good things. And <laughs> you can actually... Okay, you'll see, if you go to the feed store, they'll have like marigold extract, and I'm sure it's good for them, but that will make the caged uh, hens lay very orangey, orangey, uh, yolky eggs. Is that like, you know, is that comparable to a free range, truly free range hen eggs? I don't know, you tell me, right? I don't think so, <laughs> personally. I mean, I don't know, I mean, it looks pretty. Um, so, you know, just really stuff to think about. And, you know, I didn't know any of this until I was on the farm and I'm looking, you know, they're just running around doing all sorts of stuff, digging, scratching, looking for bugs, um, you know. And then you, you know, like, I don't think I've bought grocery store eggs in like years. Like I almost refuse to do that <laughs> at this point because I'm like, those are old. Oh, another tip. Um, you know how when you buy, um, eggs and you can make hard boiled eggs and the peel uh the egg shells come off super easy and in like the egg shape you know there might be a little flat bottom or something okay those are your pockets the older they are the bigger those pockets are okay so if you ever get like a super fresh egg from a farm like it was laid that day or two ago and you try to hard boil it <laughs> <laughs> you will not be able to get those um, shells off without a bunch of pock marks because there's no air space. Food for thought. Okay, well, there are a few tricks. So you can kind of do it if you do it in an Instapot and pressure cook it and put it in cold water real quick. Like then it's possible to get some that look half decent. But the fresher the egg, the harder it is to get those um, eggshells off. So. <laughs> all sorts of little fun stuff yeah um okay so i think that is uh where i will end um just a lot of things that you know i've thought about as i raise chickens um and if you have any comments or questions i feel truly that what we eat and how it aligns to us has a lot to do with our health and how we feel um and so you know just just stuff to think about right <laughs> and most places even homeowners association you can usually uh, have hens in your backyard and a mobile coop is a great way to go because you can just put like two or three hens in a little mobile coop and move it around your yard so it's fertilizing while they're laying eggs for you so it does take five to six months or so um, before the chick is old enough to lay eggs for most breeds, there are a lot of different breeds and a lot, oh, what are you doing? <laughs> um, but uh, you can, you know, raise hens and get fresh eggs and you can also feed them um, a lot of uh, extra leftovers and goodies like that too. And they make great pets. <laughs> okay, hope you learned something new and it was fascinating um, to a beautiful long life and I will talk to you soon. Bye.